guys and welcome back to another unfiltered gamer card game review today's game up on the tabletop is called mug shots florida man edition for terrible people with terrible friends in the game mug shots you can play i guess three or more players up until your heart's content and the objective is to uh basically align a headline from florida with a mug shot of one of the characters there's a ton of different cards in the game that'll house different characters and what they look like and there's a ton of different headlines as well maybe it's gonna say something like florida man decides to vaccinate his cat but won't vaccinate his children in which case everybody's gonna take a mug shot from their hand put it into the middle of the table shuffle it up deal them out and then the judge is going to choose this game is similar to games like cards against humanity and apples to apples and other iterations of that style of game but with a little twist on the fact that all of the cards that are the mug shots are going to be characters uh, that you can go ahead and choose from and the headlines are all based off of the uh, Florida man meme uh, if you've ever been part of the internet before you probably have heard of the Florida man aspect where it's just like Florida men doing weird and crazy things this allows you to line them up with headlines so if you like that kind of thing let me go ahead and show you down below what you get in the game and then how to play it and my review so here you have the game Florida Man Mug Shots or Mug Shots Florida Man Edition and what you're going to get in the game. There's two types of cards. You're going to get the Mug Shots and you're going to get the Headlines. And basically the idea is fairly simple like any other judging game you would see. Every player is going to get a certain amount of Mug Shot cards and these cards range in different characters uh, along with their height and then of course the ability to play a more a variant based on, based on the game uh, where you're actually taking shots based on whether you fail to get your judge to pick your character but these are the, basically the mug shots and then there's also going to be the different headlines maybe florida man butt dials police while planning their next meth cook etc etc there's quite a few of the different headlines and whatnot and of course a bunch of additional 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 cards for the game and the box along with of course the rules on the side of the box here is going to have all the different uh, headlines and whatnot for the game uh, mug shots florida man edition let's go ahead and show you basically how to play if i can get this set up right eh, whatever and then uh We'll tell you my review. Let's go down below. All right, so let's go ahead and show you how to play the game. First of all, you're going to need mug shots. And if you're playing, let's say playing with four players, every single player is going to get five of these guys here and three and four and five, along with, of course, the judge who will go ahead and set over here. And then we're going to go ahead and start a headline. And this is the judge. He's going to be judging, so he's not going to be using his mug shots. We'll take a headline and we'll place it down right here in the middle. This one says, Florida man is arrested for smoking and po smoking pot in hospital maternity ward. In which case, every other player is going to look through their uh, card sets here and determine which Florida man would be most likely arrested for smoking pot in a hospital maternity ward. And he can go ahead and just pick each of the different characters here. There's quite a variety of different crazy people. And uh, after everybody's gone ahead and picked somebody, then you're going to go ahead and take those guys and shuffle them up. Make sure that the judge doesn't know who put in what, and then flip them over. At which point, the judge is going to then go ahead and select a character that associates with the specific headline. All right, who do you think is going to be arrested for smoking pot in a maternity ward? Uh... Let's go ahead and say this guy. He looks pretty crazy, right? So this player would then win, and he would go ahead and take the mugshot card or take the uh, headline card as the point. Let's go ahead and say it was this guy over here, so he gets one point. Everybody else would then have to drink based on the shots indicated at the top left-hand corner. Now, you can go ahead and play this like Cards Against Humanity, or you can go ahead and add this little uh, attribute to the game, allowing you to uh, indulge in some libations, if you will. The rest of these cards are going to go ahead and get discarded. Everybody's going to go ahead and take an extra mugshot. And then the next player is going to be the judge. So now let's go ahead and say that this player is the judge. He won. So everybody is going to go ahead and begin again. Now this is Florida Man steals ATM from a strip club. And let's see, who's going to go ahead and steal an ATM from a strip club? Maybe this guy over here. And then how about oh, maybe this guy over here? And then finally this crazy guy over here. Shoeful, shoeful, shoeful. I think you're getting the idea of the game. Flipping these guys once again over, and Florida Man steals ATM from Strip Club. Who's likely to do that? This guy maybe thinks that, oh, I don't know, this guy is the one who does it. In which case, he'd get, an, uh, he, oh, sorry, this guy thinks this guy's the one who did it. In which case, uh, this guy, who's the one who played this card, gets the point. These guys will go ahead and get discarded, and you'll continue playing from there, giving people more and more mug shots with more and more headlines. There's, of course, a ton of different headlines in the game game that all will line up with these crazy crazy florida men <laughs> which uh brings for some pretty incredible situations and some some fun laughs let's go ahead and talk about what i think about the game 
So what is there to say about Mugshot Florida Man Edition? Well, first of all, if you're a child of the internet, you've probably heard about the crazy shenanigans that the news headlines give for the people in Florida. Now, of course, this is in jest. It's supposed to be kind-hearted humor because of all the crazy things you see online, not directly, specifically, aggressively attacking men that are from Florida. It's just the idea of how the press likes to handle men from Florida in their headlines. And, of course, all these characters are kind of mishmashed apart to, to look even crazier or psycho. They've got a lot of squishy to them and weirdness to them they have a lot of different crazy crazy images for these guys here and then of course all the headlines which i don't actually know if these are fake headlines or if these are actually headlines from like a florida man doing this or that i'm not too certain I'd, i would imagine at least a couple of them are real but let's talk about a few of them like florida man who allegedly uh, threatened family with cold play lyrics ends standoff after swap promises him a pizza Florida man threw a sex toy on field at Bills vs. Patriots Monday night football game, cops say. Arrested for attacking McDonald's employee over not getting a straw. Florida man steals ambulance with EMT inside. Accused of using makeshift flamethrower to threaten woman. Uh, appears to have special time with tree in view of passing drivers. And I think they're all pretty much that that risque like that's the spiciness of all of them i think the most spicy thing it's gonna get is there's some uh like F florida man falls victim to leprosy after having sex with an armadillo so that's probably as as crazy as the game gets as far as the headlines are concerned which makes me think that maybe there at least is some truth in some of these but i i don't know for specifics uh this game plays like cards against humanity it's it's very different in terms of how you're going to be looking at the cards as far as visually the picture is based on the headlines and it throws in that kind of memeology of the different Florida men and what you would appear or assume this specific person would in fact uh, feature uh, based on this headline. I guess you could think of it like the game Unusual Suspects a little bit without the more racial um, potential for uh, stereotyping I suppose this is more just it kind of in jest of all the different crazy people that uh, may or may not do specific situations based on maybe their looks or whatnot so for some of you that might be still a little too spicy and for others it might be just up your alley specifically if you're interested in drinking some libations while playing a game similar to cards or maybe even mixing them in together or in some way to play an even bigger game you could probably do that as well uh, the headlines are funny and they're interesting I did get a good laugh at quite a few of them as we played the game I played this at a party so this is going to be a game where you're playing at a drinking party style location i would imagine at least that's what would be for my friend group would i sit down and play this game at my house just by you know maybe me and four friends or five friends probably not so much specifically for me but i could see certain people that would want to do that but i do see this game doing well in a party situation for people that are children of the internet and enjoy the specific florida memes that are going on out there um overall it's a standard solid judging game if you like judging games and this is one that you may or may not want to pick up based on what you see below there's not much i can say as far as negatives and or positives in regard to other than just it's funny and i did laugh throughout the entire thing just seeing the different characters and faces crazy demonic looking <laughs> people smushed in their faces and their teeth all gnarly uh it, it was it was fun it was an enjoyable little game for those people that like this specific Thing, I think you're gonna find it interesting down below in the comments for those of you who are probably not interested in the style judging style game or think that there's maybe too many of them out there uh, this probably won't be for you but go ahead and check it out down below if you find it interesting Florida man mugshots a crazy crazy people edition <laughs> all right guys thanks for watching another unfiltered gamer board game review if you like this video check out the rest of my videos here on YouTube like subscribe and comment as well as checking out mugshots Florida man edition it'd be fun for you guys at the parties if you guys like the judging games this might not be one to pass up up to you take a look down below as well as take a look at our website unfilteredgamer.com tons of blog posts giveaways kickstarter lists and more our live stream every wednesday 7 30 p.m pst giving away a lot of stuff there and it supports us on patreon that's how we do our live, stream, our live streams now helping us with the shipping and whatnot of all the games that we're giving away if you like that you should definitely take a look on facebook for our live streams it's a lot of fun all right guys that's all i got for this time and as always i look forward to hopefully not seeing your mug shots in a florida headline next time